Welcome back to CBS 12 News. We all do it. We sneeze. But have you ever stopped to think about what your sneeze might mean? Well, it turns out you can tell a lot about yourself based on the way you sneeze. Here's CBS 12's Emily Pantalides now with a CBS 12 special report. It doesn't matter how old you are. If you're a man or a woman. That was a weird sneeze. Or even the president. <laughs> That's okay. We all have our signature sneezes. <laughs> so you have the, the blood curling screamer sneezes. <laughs> I'm going to have my brains come out my ears type sneezers. <laughs> you have the little cute little puff sneezes. <laughs> and my personal favorite, the like 1,000 sneezes in a row. <laughs> but why do we all sneeze differently? Dr. Richard Weinstock is an ENT in Palm Beach Gardens. I think that uh, certain personalities probably develop a certain type of sneeze. And Dr. Weinstock says your sneeze isn't always for reasons you might think. It can also even be from uh, just uh, seeing a, a, a visual or like light. When you're <laughs> sneezing, <laughs> what does it mean? So it turns out your nose may know a lot about you. Benadryl and a researcher at Newser.com came up with this brand new study where they polled 500 people and asked about their personalities and their sneeze. They came up with three types. The first, <laughs> the loud sneezers. The study said they tend to be likable, vocal leader types. Then they're the people who keep their sneezes as subtle as possible. <laughs> they like to help people stay polite and keep out of conflict. And last but not least, <laughs> the hold it in sneezers. They are independent, like to get things done. What would you say that you sneeze like? I always sneeze twice, usually loud. <laughs> so what does that say about you? You're an aggressive doctor, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> so whatever you believe about your sneeze, remember, the next time it happens to you, it isn't just a sneeze, it's your personality coming through. In Palm Beach Gardens, Emily Pantaliti, CBS 12. And Liz is completely grossed out right now. All right, now let's get to Liz and Eric with what's coming up new at 6. Hi, guys. You are correct, Suzanne. Thank you.